Hey guys, so Carrie Tatsu here, and this is my second YouTube video. And I wanted to show you how uh, <clears throat> we use this cat. Uh, Zubies is now developing a Zuby Cat Life game, and it's going to be an avatar, and also it will be used as an Animesh product. In case anybody wants to know, what is Animesh? So, Animesh is coming to SL, and it's really, really cool. It's basically where um, imagine an avatar can um, be a, a NPC, so non-playable character, but have the mesh and the animations rigging just like an avatar. So we started to develop a cat game, and this is the very first cat you can see here. He's cleaning himself right now. His name is is Spaceman. I have a cat in real life named Spaceman. Um, I want to tell you a really funny story about this. When I first joined Second Life over a decade ago, the very first product I ever made was a cat. And um, I had left Second Life for a while and then came back and I thought, well, you know what, if I'm coming back here again, let me come back as a cat and start over again with new Animesh products and avatars. Um, as a cat. I just thought that would be really, really terrific. So anyway, you can see this is like nothing you've seen before in Second Life, and it's going to be a game changer. I'm really, really excited. So I'm going to run through some of the caring um, uh, process we have here. I'll try not to say um too many times in the video, and, and uh, you guys will see what's going on here. So here we go. So if we click on um, animations, the cat will come with a HUD. In this particular release, you will be the cat and you will have tasks you need to do every day. And if you do these tasks every day, you are then rewarded with tokens, which can be redeemed for toys. Once Animesh is out, you'll be able to actually uh, get a cat. <clears throat> that is an NPC cat that looks identical to this cat. So animations, if I click on animations, there's a series of animations we can run. Um, arch back. Ooh, I'm arching my back. Um, I am begging. Oh, I'm begging. Here we go. I'm begging. I'm just standing. Stand up, cat. Come on. Okay. Laying down. Laying down. Uh, just so cute. Oh, he's a little bit cross-eyed. Oh my God. Okay. Relaxing. Um, just kind of relaxing. I'm going to show you facial expressions because he doesn't always look like this. He has a whole bunch of different facial expressions. Um, rolling over. Come on, kitty. Let's roll over. There we go. He's rolling over. Grooming. You saw that in the beginning of the video. He can groom himself just like a real cat. Um, okay. Let me also show you uh, right now he's wearing a shirt but I'm going to take the shirt off in after I go through some of these other pro, um, uh, accessories and show you he can wear a collar and he can wear sweaters and he can wear socks. And you as the player can texture all these things and sell your textures. So anyway, let's go back here and uh, show you facial expressions. You know, I think what I'm going to do actually is take his shirt off and then he's going to be invisible for a second. I'll fix that. Don't worry. Uh, he has an alpha on him so his shirt doesn't poke through too much. So I'm going to make this zero. Okay, so here we go. So now you can see he is the cutest little kitty ever um, with his little fur. I'm just, I'm in love, I am personally in love with this cat. All right, so let's have him stand. Stand up, kitty. All right, so that way you can actually see his facial expressions. Let's go back, expressions. He can be happy. Oh, are you happy? He can be sad. Oh, he's so sad. He can be excited. Ah, I'm excited. I'm an excited cat. Oh, my camera. I'm trying to get my camera to actually show you this better. Um, he can be worried. Oh, he's worried. He can have his eyes closed. Um, he can be happy again, have his eyes open. So this HUD uh, has other parts to it. There's a care system with this HUD. If you do six things every day to your cat, you're again, like I explained earlier, um, you gain tokens which can be redeemed for toys. If you ignore your cat as yourself, you're the cat this time, and you do nothing, it nothing happens. You don't die, you don't get sick, you don't lay around, you just don't get tokens for toys. I will show you a toy in a few minutes. Um, first, I'm going to show you some of these accessories. So right now, 
Um, I can, let's go to my food bowl. Meow, meow. Okay, here's my food bowl. I'm going to move this down a little bit. There we go. I am going to um, assign myself to this food bowl. Okay, so here we go. The database is looking for me. I am Spaceman the cat. Um, I'm going to add new food to the cat. So here we go. So I click this, and yes, I add food to the cat. So right now, it should work. Aha, there's food inside inside the bowl. And every, there's a little hint. Every single can like has a little quote. Way down deep, we're all motivated by the same urges. Cats have the courage to live by them. You know what? I love cats, and I just think that's awesome. So watch this. So now I'm an avatar cat, and I right-click, and I sit here, and I start eating my food. And suddenly, my food stat goes up for the day. So if I eat food every day, I get this food stat. If I clean myself, if I get love, if I play, if I get rest, and if I use my litter box every day, I gain a token. And again, those tokens can, re can be redeemed for toys. So to stop eating like any avatar stopping an animation, I stand up. Woo, I'm standing up. All right, so now let me show you another really cool thing. Oh, that's my bed. I haven't gone to my bed yet. So I'm going to walk over here, walk over here. Oh, the walking is perfect. Look at this, walking around. Oh, I'm running right now. I'm running, but I can walk too. Um, so let me show you this. Let's turn this around. I will go use my bed. So again, with any uh, avatar animation, you have to sit on it for it to run. So I'm going to run, click, and sit. Oh my goodness, here I go. I'm going to go use my bed. Oh, look at this, here I go. I'm a cute little kitty in my bed. Now also the accessories come with uh, texture options. So here I can go in and I can make my bed yellow. It will update, I can make my bed blue. It will update. And now to stop using the accessory, I stand up. Now look, if you see here, I used my bed for the day and so I'm rested. Now, one really awesome thing about this is that not only can I assign these accessories to myself, but I can also have my friend, who is also a cat, join me in my cat community and use my bed. So over here, if I call on the sign, it says Spaceman's assigned to this bed. However, if another cat named Grover was in my sim and I wanted to assign him to the same bed, I could unassign myself, assign him, and he can get the same stat boost from my bed. That's pretty cool. He can also use my food bowl and I can go and I can buy him food and he can eat from my bowl. So it's a completely immersive experience, multiplayer cat life experience. It's not just an avatar cat that you've seen before, even though the avatar cat itself is kind of pretty awesome the way he moves. Okay, so now let's go play. Oh, he's cleaning himself. Oh my goodness, he's cleaning himself. Look at this. I gotta just show you guys this close up. This is like nothing you've ever seen. So initially you will be the cat and then we will have NPC cats that also can use these accessories. Okay, so again, I'm gonna show you this thing, catnip. So this will cover the boost of play. So if I right click and sit on my catnip, yes, I'm going to use this. Here we go. Oh my gosh, he's gonna go run these animations. Wait till you see this. You're gonna love this. Yes, I need to attach this. Ah, here we go. He's gonna go bananas, watch this. There he goes, he's rubbing himself. He's eating the catnip. Again, this is like no avatar you've seen in Second Life. This is like a real, a simulated cat for VR. It's so, so cool. I'm so, so excited about this product. I can't express to you my excitement. Okay, now look, the stat boost has been raised. So now he has had, he's had play time, he's had rest time, he's eaten food. At any time, I can stand up. And when I, oh, he, look, he just threw that up. Oh my God. So, okay, I'm going to stand up, stand up. All right, so now 
he has used his catnip. And any time, if I right click and sit, I can eat food, I can lay in my bed, and I can use the catnip for the um, the duration of the product. Now, the, well, for the it depends. So for the bed, I can use it indefinitely. For the catnip, there is a timer on it because it's a consumable. And for the food, there's a timer on it. But so certain accessories you can use forever and ever, never having to use them uh, again. And other ones, there's a timer on them. Okay, so let's move over. And now here is my litter box. This is funny. You will not believe this. So the first thing I'm going to do is I am going to add litter to my box. So, or actually, I think I have to assign myself to the box first. So I'm going to assign myself to the box. I am assigned to the box. Okay, spaceman, I'm spaceman. New litter, here we go. Now I need to add litter. Yes, I'm adding litter. Okay, so now there's litter in the box. So if I go and I right click and sit again, hold on here, here we go, jumping in the box. Ah, oh, sorry, I want you to see this. He is running animations that actually, I'm going to show him pooping. I have to, I have to show him pooping. Here we go. He's, oh, he's peeing. He's peeing out. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought he was going to poop. He's peeing out of the box this time and now he's cleaning it up. Oh my God, I'm dying. Okay. All right. So now let me see if he's going to poop. No, he may not. He may not. So let's see what else. Now we have other, oh, here he is, he's laying down, he's laying down. Now let me show you what else is going on with this cat. We have really, really cool accessories for him. He can wear a cat hat, he can wear a cat sweater, he can wear a cat socks, he can wear so many different things and you can texture these things for him. So if I go here and I put some clothing on him, um, here is his sweater. Here we go. He's wearing a little pink sweater now. Okay, let me see if he can stand up. There we go. There's the sweater. I can put a pom-pom hat on him. There we go. He's wearing a pom-pom hat. Again, like nothing you have seen in Second Life. Look at that cat. Look at that. Oh my god, I'm just dying. Uh, he can wear socks. Okay, now watch. These are white socks, but we have different textured socks. Uh, let me show you this. Um, we can make striped pink socks. Oh my god, look at this cat. Striped pink socks, a hat, and a sweater, and we have a collar. Let me find a collar for him here. Okay, so he can wear a collar. If you see, you probably can't see it very well here. Here's his collar. Okay, so here is his collar. Yeah, pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. He has a built in AO. Um, and let me show you one of the toys. Well, actually, this isn't a toy. I'm going to show you one of the um, accessories he gets if you care for him. It's a shark suit. So let me show you the shark suit, which I am just love this shark suit. It's, again, like nothing you've ever seen before. <laughs> Let's add the shark suit. All right, now let them walk around. So here he is. He's got socks, he's wearing a shark suit, and he is the most adorable cat you will ever see in Second Life. Now, he's not the only color. We're going to have white cats and tabby cats and pink cats and all sorts of cats that you could possibly imagine. But the fun thing is that it's not just a cat avatar. This is a cat game. So you're given tasks. Um, you are you you can play with other friends. We're gonna eventually have um, other small games incorporated into this system. It's just a really really cool product. Again, this is preparation for Animesh, which is coming. So in this case, you'll get to be the cat, but in the future, you'll be a cat, and there will be an NPC cat. 
Okay, I think that's it. I'm going to stop this. So thanks everyone and expect some really cool products coming from Zubies.